Goshen City FC is back for their second season after a successful campaign last year, ending the season with five wins, two draws, and three losses. They will once again call the Goshen College Soccer Complex home. Enrique Eichenberger, the president and assistant coach of Goshen City FC, has high hopes coming off of last season. Yeah, so last year we had to, to prove to everybody that we, we were a good team, we were a, a professional environment. And I think this year it's a little bit easier to recruit good players because they want to play for us. They saw that we, we are a good team. I see our team having a more solid program than last year. So I'm excited to see where we can go this year. Assistant Athletic Director of Operations and Communications at Goshen College, Justin DeWeese, is looking forward to the partnership. The Goshen City FC crowd is a crowd that maybe hasn't been to Goshen College before, probably hasn't been to a Goshen College athletic event. And so you're bringing in a new demographic, a new set of fans that haven't been there. And so when you do that, you know, they're experiencing probably our fields for the first time. And so then it's sort of like, well, hey, if you like soccer, like there's also the Goshen College men's and women's soccer team that are playing here in the fall. And then maybe even down the road saying, hey, you had a kid that came to this game. Maybe they'd be interested in attending Goshen College. While the team has excelled on the pitch, they have also been an active presence in the Goshen community. This project is not only playing soccer and having fun, we want to connect with the community and the city. We went to the Habitat for Humanity, we built homes for people in need. We went to three First Fridays, we volunteer, and we plan to do those things again. The fans you've seen here have been little kids, older adults, it's been GC students, you know, during May term games and GC employees. Um, so it's been a real mix of people as well, which has been really cool to see. Goshen City FC will face a difficult opponent to start off the season in just a few weeks. One of the highlights of the season for sure. I think it's going to be the first time ever that an MLS academy comes to Elkhart County, so I'm pretty excited about it. The team will have five home games, with one being played at Goshen High School. I have been working since December, November, and everything behind the scenes, and I can't wait to get on the field and watch my team play. and win games and reach uh, the final, the quarterfinal, whatever. But yeah, I'm pretty excited to go out there and be on the field that that's where I come from. And yeah, I really want to start. Reporting for Globe Sports, I'm Alyssa McDonald.